In this video, we'll balance the equation AgNO3 plus K2CO3, silver nitrate plus potassium carbonate. Let's count the atoms up on each side of the equation. Ag, we have one, and then NO3 is a polyatomic ion. It appears here and here. So we're gonna count this nitrate ion, this polyatomic ion is just one item. That'll make balancing much easier. We have two potassiums, and then we have another polyatomic ion, the carbonate ion. It appears here, and we also have it on the other side of the equation. So we can count that as one item right there. We have two silvers, we have one nitrate ion, we have one potassium and one carbonate. Well, let's just balance the silvers. We have two here and one here. So we'd need to put a coefficient of two in front of the AgNO3, one times two. That'll balance the silvers, but this two applies to everything. We have a nitrate here, one nitrate times two. That'll give us two nitrate ions. Let's balance the potassiums next, and that might even fix the nitrates as well. So we have two here and one here. Let's put a coefficient of two in front of the potassium nitrate, one times two. So our potassiums are fixed, and the nitrate, one of these times this two here, that'll give two of those, and we're done. This equation is balanced. So by counting the polyatomic ions as one item, if they appear on both sides, makes it a lot easier to balance. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for silver nitrate plus potassium carbonate. Thanks for watching.